Day 2011 here in London's Victoria Park. It's the fifth year the Field Day has happened and the lineup is utterly incredible. You've got brand new bands like 254 going through to John Cale, right the way from War Paint into Anna Calvi. It's just the most eclectic and brilliant new artist lineup. When you're out here, you got the pump because you got a field and a space, and you got a bunch of people. So you have to play the strong music. Sometimes I think we're not the biggest festival band. Festivals can be sort of a double edged sword for me. I, I sort of fear them, but I also see them as a challenge. And today felt a lot easier than usual. I don't know, it was just something clicked, and we, I guess we played a bit of a rockier set as well. What was the initial idea behind starting Field Day? A big sort of village fate, I guess, with a really good music lineup that's, you know, my record collection in a field. My I don't actually want to go and see Wild Beasts, but I don't know if we're on the same time. People have been really giving, like in the crowd, the response has been unlike anything that's ever had. So, and that's been just amazing. Field Day's become, a, I think, a bit of the establishment in a way. That's sort of what it represents in the bands that play today. You know, to be uh, uh, the cherry on that cake is yeah. it's a good place to be, I think.